Hi, my name is Alessandro Cava and this is The Stock Table. Today, I will be talking about a company that many people probably haven't heard of. However, for a large portion of you, they hold a small but crucial role in your life. Aircap Holdings, a commercial aircraft leasing company that is ever so growing in terms of profitability. Founded in 1995, headquartered in North Holland, Netherlands. On average, they buy, sell, or lease one aircraft every 24 hours. They are the largest aircraft leasing company in the world. In 2016, they were rated number 13 on the Fortune 100 list. Now, let's talk a little bit about what this company is doing to continue to grow. As the aircraft industry gets bigger, which it does, every 15 years, air traffic doubles on average. This company seems to always get in on the action. During quarter four of 2016, Aircap made history. They made a deal with Spirit Airlines to deliver the Airbus A320 NEO, making this the first airline in the U.S. To, to receive this type of aircraft. They are always getting on top of the best and latest aircrafts so they can be the first to sell them and so they can make a name for themselves. Now, let's talk about the financials, which is the biggest and most important thing in stocks. When the quarter one 2017 earnings report came out, it worried some people because it was down in revenue by 130 million and down in earnings per share for the quarter by 53 cents. Now that seems major, but the reason for this is their quarter four 16 earnings report showed a very, very strong and record quarter. This was mostly because, like I previously noted, they delivered the new Airbus to Spirit Airlines. This created a want for that aircraft in some of the other major airlines around the globe, which in turn increased their revenue and profitability for the quarter. Their financials are very good, and they have a 21% profit margin. They have an increased net profit of almost $38 million from quarter one of 2016 to quarter one of 2017. Now, for these reasons, this stock is a buy now. And while it is a good long-term investment, this stock will go up in the short term. They have had an increased excess capital in their latest quarter and look to be able to repurchase more stock than they had originally thought and planned for. This will in turn drive the price up. That's huge. Another reason for this stock to buy is because it is extremely undervalued. They have a price earnings ratio of 7.87 an earnings per share of $5.88. You can buy a share currently at $46. They have gone up 3% in the last five days alone. For these reasons, this stock is a buy now. Don't forget to subscribe below and follow me on Twitter at the stock table. No caps, no spaces. Have a great day.